www.usbjtech.com products explained. In this video, I'm going to talk about the products. On my left is USB BDM NT, and the second one is USB JTAG NT, the third one is Ulink NT, and the last one is Ulink NAND. First of all, on my left, there are two products. They look very similar, and people are often confused, and they all often order the wrong parts. The BDM NT and JTAG NT looks very similar. USB and one it has 10 pins cable and the second one is the 14 pin cable. BDM and JTAG are two protocols. The design for USB BDM NT is to work with Motorola MC683XX uh, CPUs. And the layout of this 10 pin is exactly the same as standard BDM layout. The design for JTAG NT initially was for MIPS JTAG and it has standard 14 pins. The internal hardware has a different design, even though they look very similar but different designs. So one will not replace the other. So if this one works with the Motorola CPU, this will not. If you were working with modems like 5101 or modem 3s like using SPIs, they are uh, designed for the JTAG NT. So you need all of this thing. Instead, if you were working on the car engine CPUs, they use BDM NT. Now, this one is obsolete. Uh, we have a new design, which is smaller design called Ulink NT. And the Ulink NT is designed to completely replace the JTAG NT and 100% feature compatible and even more. So this one support more. The design philosophy is different. This one has standard MIPS JTAG. So it's designed for MIPS JTAG but also support some like ARMs, some uh, SPIs, E-squares. Ulink NT does not have special target to as its parent model. So all the pins are programmable. So it can be configured to use on MIPS and also on ARMs and also on STI uh, targets. That's the initial design to cover the JTAG NT. This one is no longer for sale. It's, it's gone. But the confusion here is people still see the software is called USB JTAG NT because historically this is a master and this is like a slave. So the software is unified. Even though you have the BDM NT, you are still using the JTAG NT software. And even today, if you use Unic NT, we use the same software. And what's more, this one is called Unique NAND and it's only designed for programming the NAND flash. Okay, not, not designed for anything else, not going to be replaced the Unique NT. But the internal design is similar such that it runs the same software. So all four targets, uh, all, all four modules here, all four modules here use the same software called USB JTAG NT. Now there's another software called UJ Modern. UJ modeling is specific design for modern programming and it only works for the JTAG NT soft hardware as well as the uh, Ulink NT hardware. So UJ modeling work those two hardwares. USB JTAG NT work all the hardwares. Even though you have uh, old hardware of USB JTAG NT, you can still use the latest software. The latest software features upgrade will still cover the JTAG NT, but this one is no longer for sale. So you are not going to buy from uh, my site to get the hardware. You can only get the BDM NT and the Ulink NT, and sometime later you will have the Ulink NAND. Majority of people use Ulink NT, okay? So if you are not sure, you should send email to us, say, you know, what are you are want, want to do. Don't necessarily think this because you have a 10, ten pin headers, you are going to order the BDM NT will cover you. Uh, 5101 use the uh, MIPS JTAG, 
you're not going to use this one. You use JTAG NT, you're the first 10 pins, or you use Unink NT to work with the SP5101. Uh, if you want with SPI flashes, use Unink NT. If you work with the uh, ARM chips, use the Unink NT. If you are not sure which product to order, please send email to ask before you order.